Yo, yo, yo. Today's topic, we're going to be talking about exposing the new world agenda, new world order. And I want to start off, I'm going to start off with, yes, the Illuminati does exist because it's true. Um, I know a lot of people out there, they don't believe um, that the secret society exists, but they do. And there's there's proof on it. Like there's a lot of proof on it. Just it's just people don't want to look into it. And um, even the people that are looking into it, they're just looking into uh, the wrong places. You know what I mean? So we're gonna get into this. The first thing I really want to talk about right now because it's it's pretty relevant is um, weather warfare and man-made weather. Now, these people have the ability to manipulate any weather pattern out there. I know a lot of people who aren't awake are going to be like, you're bullshitting, you're lying, and it's just not true. But I'm telling you the truth. These people have the power to change and manipulate the weather. It all goes back to the, um, the fallen angels and the devil and Satan. You know what I mean? These people were, um, these fallen angels had the technology to do this forever. Ever since they were, since God cast them to the earth, they already had this information. But we're in a time now called the end times where the government is using this technology to cause chaos and to depopulate the world. Now the Illuminati consists of 13 satanic bloodlines and they all connect under the devil. So at the, if, you, if you flip over your dollar bill, your $1 bill, you look on the back of it, you see the pyramid, and then you see the eye at the top of the pyramid. The eye at the top of the pyramid resembles Satan. And under that, there, there would be the 13 bloodlines. And then under that would be the corporation, or um, not the corporations, but... Um, bankers, all the uh, the fake Jewish bankers, they're not the real Jews, they're the fake Jews, and then under that will be, will fall corporations, and under that would be the people, or um, the ce- like celebrities and puppets, you know what I mean, and then under that, it's just the people, so it's, it's basically a huge pyramid scheme, it's literally we're living in a pyramid scheme, literally. And people don't understand that. At the top is the devil, and then under it is the Illuminati, the people that actually are the Illuminati. You know what I mean? Those are the 13 satanic bloodlines, which is the Illuminati. Everyone underneath that are just puppets for the Illuminati. Except for, obviously, um, the masses. The masses are in complete darkness right now because... They're just asleep. But the Illuminati is real. And these people are Satanists and they sacrifice. They do all types of fucking crazy, disgusting, demonic rituals. You know what I'm saying? It's proven. They, these people even tell you in subli- like subliminally. They do. They tell you subliminal- subliminally everything they do. know what I mean so we have no excuse to fucking not or we have no excuse to not call them out on it and a lot of people they just don't see it and when people bring it up it's just what they did right they would be or um, what they did to the term Illuminati they just basically made a mockery of it they just made jokes around it so no one would take it serious and guess what nobody's taking it serious but guess what we gonna have to take this shit serious You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's not a game, man. It's not a game. And this shit... This shit is just... It's sad, you know what I mean? Because to see... To see... Um, innocent people and people in general just be... Deceived, you know what I mean? It, it hurts because... These people are just drowning in darkness. 
could literally, or in my in my perspective, I could literally see dark darkness around these people for real. I see demons around these people because they're just lost and they have demonic influence all over them. And the main reason, if not the main reason, why they have demonic influence all over them is because of sin. Once you once you let sin into you, that it's like opening a portal or a gateway to allow demonic um, uh, demonic forces to mess with your soul and your mind and your heart and all of that. You know what I mean? It's sin. That's what I was saying. Like before, it's not a game because people be out here just committing sin day to day to day not thinking and then they wondering and questioning why a whole, why their life is just falling apart and why their whole entire life um, certain things happen to them but they would just when they do that they, they just blame God they don't actually pray to God and ask him for um, insight and knowledge you know what I mean they don't pray to Jesus they just honestly I see I've seen some crazy junk. I won't get into that right now. But what was I talking about? Um, oh yeah, I'm gonna read this list off of people that were murdered by the Illuminati. Whether it was because they wanted to rebel against it or they just didn't fit into the system no more. They didn't need them, so they offed them. That's what they do. They're they sacrifice people. Oh, yeah. Oh, I was about to sneeze. <laughs> My fault. But they sacrifice people. But let me read this list real quick to you guys. Of uh, a few people, or more than a few people, that were off by the Illuminati. So, you got Abraham Lincoln, J JFK, uh, Robert Kennedy, JFK, Jr., Malcolm X, Martin Luther King, John Pope John Paul I, Jamie or Jaime Roldas, Muammar Gaddafi, Princess, or Princess Diana. So that was just a couple of people, but what I want to go back to um, right now and talk about is how these satanic elitists, these scumbags, that they sacrificed kids, they sacrificed innocent children. You know what I'm saying? It just, it literally takes the life out of you just like talking about it and listening to it. But we really got to talk about this stuff because it's really going on. We have to keep talking about it because it's really going on. And I'm sick and tired of people just not talking about this. I'm, I'm tired of it. Even though I don't like talking about it because it's just, it's so negative and so demonic. You know what I mean? But we have to expose it or it's just going to keep going on. So these Satanists, they sacrifice kids. They, they actually rape them. They drink their semen because this is what these demonic fucks believe. That drinking a child's semen after you rape them will give you their life force is absolutely fucking wicked these people drink these children's semen and they claim that they get life force from it which they do because they wouldn't do it if it didn't work you know what I mean it's fucking disgusting these people are pedophiles and they're murderers and they have no regard for human life they have no fucking regard for human life. This shit just fucking makes me sick. So these people, that's just one ritual, one type of sacrifice these fucking people do. But to me, that's the most important one because these kids are innocent children. Innocent children are being murdered, raped and murdered. get you fired up to go against these people, these fucking celebrities, against, um, 
these fucking Illuminati ass fucking pieces of garbage, these Satanists that do this, and all of these people are fucking cowards. They're all cowards. I mean, you go up to one of these dudes, you ask them about it, they'll be like, what the fuck are you talking about? They'll be like, what are you saying? We don't do that. We're atheists. And it's just a whole bunch of fucking games. These people are, are fucking, they, they play the game, you know what I mean? And they play it, they play it well, but not well enough for people like me. Because we play it better than them. We're exposing this shit. I don't give a fuck about it. no demons. I don't pray for demons. I don't pray for none of these motherfuckers. I pray for everyone out here that has a soul. If you don't have a soul, I'm not praying for you. It doesn't make any sense. Why would you pray for these people? You think they're people, but really on the inside, these people's souls are gone and there's a demonic fucking entity inside of them. That's the shit they don't tell you on TV. That's the shit you, you will never hear. That's the shit that you will never hear. Well, I'm going to end this video right here, guys. And I hope and I pray that you can see this, what's going on in this world. Because it's pissing me the fuck off. And it's already been pissing me off for a while. It's just, I just got to speak on it now because it's, you know, God, God's really calling me to do this. So I'm, a, I'm definitely abiding by God, the most high in Christ. I'll be damned if I if I stray away. I'll be damned. I'd rather be killed. I'd rather be physically killed. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? This is the truth. God is the truth. The most high is the truth. Jesus Christ is the truth. If you can't accept it, hey, I don't know what to tell you. But I pray for you guys out there. God bless you and your families. Shalom. 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 Shalom.